Hello and welcome to Farming Know How, the channel that brings you the best insights into agriculture from around the world. Today, we're embarking on a fascinating journey, a journey that takes us to every corner of our planet, exploring the incredible diversity of cattle breeds. From the lush green pastures of Europe to the sweeping plains of Africa, from the vast landscapes of the Americas to the diverse terrains of Asia and Australia, cattle have adapted and evolved in fascinating ways. Each breed is a testament to the resilience and adaptability of these amazing creatures, with unique characteristics shaped by the environments they inhabit and the roles they play in our agricultural systems. So, buckle up, and get ready for an exciting exploration of the magnificent world of cattle breeds, their unique traits, and their significant contributions to farming and agriculture across the globe. Join us as we embark on this exciting journey, exploring the magnificent world of cattle breeds. Cattle breeds are as diverse as the continents they originate from. They're living testaments to the rich history of human civilization and our long-standing relationship with these incredible creatures. Let's start with a global overview. Each continent, from Europe, North America, South America, Asia, Africa to Australia has developed its own distinctive cattle breeds. This variety is not merely a product of chance, Instead, it's a reflection of the historical and geographical factors that have shaped the development of these breeds over centuries. Consider Europe. The continent is home to some of the most renowned dairy and beef breeds, such as the black and white Holstein Frisian, known for its high milk production, and the Angus, prized for its superior beef quality. These breeds have been shaped by the fertile pastures, the climate, and the agricultural practices of the region. Now let's cross the Atlantic to North America. Here, breeds like the Texas Longhorn have been molded by the rugged landscapes and harsh climatic conditions. These cattle are known for their hardiness, adaptability, and stress tolerance, traits that make them perfect for the challenging environments they inhabit. South America, on the other hand, boasts cattle breeds like the Nalor, which have evolved to thrive in tropical conditions. These cattle are incredibly heat-tolerant and resistant to many diseases that affect cattle in other parts of the world. Asia's cattle breeds, such as the Zebu, have adapted to a wide range of climates, from the hot, humid tropics to the cold, high-altitude regions. Africa, too, has its unique breeds like the long-horned Ankalawatusi, adapted to survive in the diverse and often harsh African environments. Down under in Australia, we find breeds like the Brahmin, a beef cattle breed known for its resilience and adaptability to the country's harsh climatic conditions. These breeds, each with their unique traits, play a significant role in the agricultural systems of their respective regions. They're not just livestock. They're an integral part of our global heritage, a testament to human ingenuity and adaptability. And, understanding them, offers us a glimpse into the fascinating world of farming and the rich tapestry of life on our planet. Europe, with its rich farming history, has given us some of the most popular cattle breeds. This continent, known for its diverse landscapes and climates, is home to a variety of cattle breeds, each with their own unique characteristics and uses. Let's begin with the Holstein Frisian, a breed native to the Netherlands and Germany. Known for their distinctive black and white markings, these cattle are considered the world's highest dairy producers. A single Holstein Frisian cow can produce an average of 22,000 pounds of milk per year. Now isn't that impressive? Next we have the Angus, originally from Scotland. These solid black or red cattle are renowned for their high-quality beef. The meat is well-marbled, tender, and packed with flavor, making Angus beef a favorite among meat lovers worldwide. The Hereford breed, originating from England, is another beef cattle breed. Herefords are adaptable, easy to manage, and known for their high fertility rates. They're often recognized by their deep red to rust-colored bodies, contrasted by white faces, crests, and underbellies. Moving on to France, we find the Charolais, a breed known for its muscular build and light wheat-colored coat. Charolais cattle are dual-purpose animals used for both milk and meat production. This breed's meat is lean yet succulent, making it a popular choice for many. Lastly, we have the Simmental, a breed that traces its roots back to Switzerland. These cattle are among the oldest and most widely distributed breeds in the world. Simmentals are appreciated for their versatility, being used for milk, meat, and draft work. These breeds, each with their distinctive characteristics and uses, have significantly contributed to the global agricultural scene. From the high milk yield of the Holstein Frisian to the quality beef of the Angus and the versatility of the Cemental, 
these European cattle breeds have made their mark in farming landscapes worldwide. These breeds, with their unique characteristics, have significantly contributed to global agriculture. Europe's legacy in cattle farming continues to shape our agricultural practices, enhancing our productivity, and enriching our culinary experiences. Let's continue our journey around the globe to discover more about the world's fascinating cattle breeds. The Americas, both North and South, host a variety of unique and adaptable cattle breeds. Let's start our journey in the Northern Hemisphere, with the Brahmin. Known for their large hump over the top of their shoulders and neck, Brahmins are remarkable for their heat tolerance and resistance to insects making them a top choice for ranchers in warmer climates. Moving westward we find the Texas Longhorn, an iconic symbol of the American West. These cattle are celebrated for their hardiness and adaptability, thriving in harsh environments where other breeds might struggle. Their long curved horns which can span up to 7 feet are one of their most distinguishing features. Another North American breed worth mentioning is the Santa Gertrudis. First developed on the King Ranch in Texas, these cattle are a cross between Brahmin and Shorthorn breeds, combining the best traits of both. They are recognized for their heat resistance, rapid growth, and excellent beef quality. Now let's journey south to the vast landscapes of South America, where we encounter the Brayford. A cross between Hereford and Brahmin, Braffords are appreciated for their hardiness, fertility, and adaptability to a variety of environmental conditions. They are primarily used in beef production, providing high-quality meat with excellent marbling. Next, we have the Brangus, a breed that also combines the traits of the Brahman and Angus. Brangus cattle are renowned for their resistance to heat and insects as well as their superior meat quality and high fertility rates. Last but certainly not least, we have the Nilor. Originating from India, Nilor were brought to Brazil in the late 19th century where they flourished. These cattle are celebrated for their adaptability to tropical climates, resistance to diseases, and lean beef quality. These breeds known for their resilience and unique traits, are a testament to the diverse agricultural landscape of the Americas. Each breed is a story of evolution, adaptation, and survival, playing a vital role in shaping the rich tapestry of American cattle farming. Asia and Africa, with their diverse climates and cultures, are home to some of the most distinctive cattle breeds. Let's embark on a journey across these enchanting continents, exploring their unique bovine inhabitants. First, we head to Asia, where the ancient zebu breed reigns supreme. Known for its distinctive hump and droopy ears, the zebu is a breed that's adapted to thrive in the tropical climates of Asia. Its resistance to heat and disease makes it an invaluable asset in the region's agricultural systems. Next we find the Sahiwal breed, originating from the Sahiwal district in Pakistan. This breed is highly prized for its dairy production, being one of the best milk producers under tropical conditions. It's also known for its heat tolerance and resistance to ticks, making it a perfect fit for the challenging environments of Asia. Moving on we encounter the Ankole Watusi, a breed that, while native to Africa, has found a home in Asia too. This breed is instantly recognizable by its massive horns, which can reach up to 8 feet from tip to tip. Remarkably, these horns also serve a practical purpose, circulating blood to help the animal cool down in hot temperatures. Now let's journey to Africa, the cradle of the Nguni breed. The Nguni cattle are small, hardy animals, well adapted to the harsh African conditions. They're also highly regarded for their cultural and economic significance to the local communities. In the arid regions of East Africa, we find the Boran cattle. These robust animals are renowned for their superior beef quality and hardiness in dry climates. The Boran's resilience makes it a key player in Africa's livestock industry. Last but not least, we meet the Afrikaner cattle. Known for their red hide and long upward curving horns, the Afrikaner is a true symbol of African cattle farming. This breed is celebrated for its strength and endurance, often used in traditional plowing due to its incredible pulling power. These breeds play a vital role in the traditional farming systems and local economies of their regions. Their unique characteristics and adaptations not only highlight the beauty of biological diversity, but also remind us of the intimate bond between these animals and the lands they inhabit. Australia with its unique climate and geography hosts a variety of adaptable cattle breeds. Let's take a moment to appreciate some of these resilient varieties. First up we have the Angus, originating from Scotland, yet has thrived in the Australian environment. Noted for its superior meat quality and maternal instincts, the Angus is a staple in Australian beef production. Next we have the Murray Grey, an Australian native breed. 
This breed is renowned for its versatility and adaptability to various climatic conditions. Its easy calving and high feed conversion efficiency make it a favorite among farmers. Lastly, there's the Brahmin. This breed, with its distinctive hump and large droopy ears, is a testament to adaptability. Originating from India, the Brahmin thrives in Australia's tropical regions, proving its resilience to heat and insects. These breeds, with their unique traits and adaptability, contribute significantly to Australian agriculture. We've journeyed across continents exploring the rich diversity of cattle breeds. From the robust Holstein Frisian of Europe to the adaptable Brahmin from the Americas, each breed has its unique characteristics and roles in agriculture. We've seen how historical and geographical factors have shaped the development of these breeds and the importance of genetic diversity in cattle farming. We've discovered that whether it's the Zebu from Asia or the Nguni from Africa, these breeds are not just important to traditional farming systems, but also play a vital role in local economies. Down under in Australia, we've seen how breeds like the Angus and Murray Gray have adapted to the country's climatic conditions. It's clear that the world of cattle is a vast and varied one, full of unique breeds that each play a crucial role in global agriculture. Thank you for joining us on this exciting journey. Don't forget to subscribe to Farming Know-How for more informative content on farming and livestock.